If you love your liver and intestines, leave Michelle Rivera alone. Hey, my wonderful sweet babies. Thank you for joining me. Make sure you like the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new around these parts and make sure you drop a comment so that I know that you stopped by. Now, let's get into the mess. This weekend, we have a lightweight eliminator bout between Frank Martin and Michelle Rivera. This is the kind of matchup that I personally live for. These two are both up and coming contenders, pretty much on the same level. And I think whoever wins this fight is gonna be next up. Michelle Rivera is a 24 year old Dominican boxer with a record of 24 and 0. He's five foot nine with a 71 inch arm reach. He fights in an orthodox stance. I think Rivera has seven or eight more fights than Martin, so he's a little bit more experienced. Although these two have been fighting about the same level of competition. What I like about Rivera, he's really good in the speed department and his power is also really good. He's got a solid jab and he does excellent body work. If you love your liver and intestines, leave Michelle Rivera alone. He pretty much run all the rounds that he fought in his last fight against Jerry Perez and he's just been getting progressively better every time I see him fight. Now, Frank Martin, he's a bit older than Rivera. He's 27 years old. He's a Southpaw from Detroit, Michigan. His record is 16 and 0 with 12 KOs. Now I have to say, 75% KO ratio is pretty freaking ridiculous if I do say so myself. Even fighting lower tier comp, that's still pretty legit. So chef's kiss in the power department for Martin. I also think one advantage is his excellent punch placement. I think that's due to his trainer, Mr. Derek James, who was spotted earlier this week with the number one heavyweight. But anywho, back to business. In Martin's last outing, he stopped Jackson Mourinho's in the last round. And I saw that fight live. And I remember thinking Martin was getting touched up a bit until he ticked it up a notch and he was able to stop Mourinho's. I think this fight is going to be decided before the championship rounds because that's where both of their sweet spots are. Michelle Rivera shines in the early rounds with his combinations and his body work, whereas Frank Martin breaks the opponent down in spurts over the course of the fight. That might be a problem because Michelle does have good footwork and his ability to fight at range is also really good. Now, both sides of my family are divided about this fight. It's a 50-50 fight. It's about as 50-50 as a fight can be. But there's no middle ground here. If it goes the distance, I see Rivera edging it on a split decision. And if I have to pick, I'm going to go with Rivera by stoppage in either the 10th or 11th rounds. But anyway, sweet babies, you guys tell me what you think. Who's going to win this fight? Most of the people I talk to say they have Frank Martin. And I can see why. I feel like no matter who you pick, it's a safe bet because this is very, very, very much so a 50-50 fight. Anyway, and next, until next time, sweet babies. Look out for the